Today we are building a $10,000 micro apartment versus a $100 micro apartment. I get the $10,000 budget to build my very own micro apartment right in this section. But I can't do it alone, so I'm gonna need to recruit some help. Samuel, wanna help me build? Sure. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Let's get to work. This is my area to build the $100 micro apartment. And we have this tarp here dividing our sections. That way we can't see what the other team is building until we're done. Make this the main room. And then we could make this the entrance. And on the second level, we could build all the way over this. I love it. Oh no. Why are we still here? $100 is not a lot and wood is not very cheap. So I think my game plan is to try to find as much free wood and free materials as I can and then just create some type of structure out of the materials I'm able to get. Free wood. I'm getting ready to spend the first bit of my budget, five bucks. I found someone selling a little pile of scrap wood. So let's get it. That's all I have so far. Samuel, what do we need? Two by fours that are eight feet long, two by fours that are 10 feet long. We need two by sixes and then plywood. They said all of these pallets are free so I can take as many as I want. This will be perfect for my micro apartment. Let's go. Ow. So you guys have probably all seen our other micro builds like any of these, but for this one, we wanted to do something different and level it up a bit, which I think this new structure is gonna be our coolest build yet. Let's just hope it doesn't fall apart. Got all our wood back, now it's time to get cutting. The first walls of our micro apartment have just went up, looking pretty epic. I have $70 left of total budget. All the wood I previously had was $5, which is the same price as one two by four. Ah, it's getting pricey. I can use these as walls. So basically 20 bucks for my walls. Hopefully I have enough for a ceiling. Trying to get some flooring just to make sure my micro apartment is really comfy. Oh, foam would definitely be more comfortable, but I don't think it'll cover as much. If I get the carpet, I'll have enough to do upstairs and downstairs. Day two, back at it again. Let's get it. Time to hang up the second story because we're gonna have multiple stories in this micro apartment. And just to clarify, we're not doing two stories. We're doing three stories. It's gonna be crazy. All right, I am working on a layout with my pallets here. So here's the big problem. This pallet is a lot smaller than these two. So that makes trying to be even and make it all perfect impossible. Once we are done with our build, Andrew and I both have to spend overnight in our micro apartments. We are making some serious progress. I'm on the third story right now and we just built a ladder that goes down all the way to the bottom. Oh man, this is going to be the coolest micro house I think we've built. I'm changing my design slightly. It's still gonna be cool. And I'm using the pallets, but I had to use Home Depot supplies. That's looking pretty good. We're making more progress. Impressed. I just built a ladder, so I'm gonna test it going up to the second level. The rooftop is coming along very nicely. We basically have every single wall installed now. We're gonna put some windows in. Let's go spy on Andrew. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> all right guys, I have completely finished my build. I'm getting sweaty and I'm all done. Still working on the build. This time, painting the walls. I don't think you're ready for what kind of accessories I got for my micro apartment, but let me just say, it's gonna blow your mind. Guarantee you haven't seen it before. Justin and I are all done building our micro apartments. It's time to give you a tour. We're starting with mine because I only had a hundred bucks. All right, so this is the front door. It opens just like this and you can come inside. This is the first level. And because our micro apartments had to have two levels, I have this ladder here that I built that goes upstairs to the second level. I wasn't able to get enough material to do the whole thing, which is why these pallets came in handy, which actually gives it a cool vibe. You know, this is like a, an accent wall now. My floor is actually really comfy. I got this carpet pad that takes up the bottom and top floors. So I can lay down here. This is the, the bedroom with my lamp. Anyways, I did build this shelf back here as well. And I've got an activity for later and you're gonna love this shelf. This is, get a close up of this. This is a live edge piece of wood. This is very rare. These things can cost you hundreds of dollars. <sighs> ah, who put that beam there? Oh my gosh, it actually worked. I told you it works. What's the second level use for? Um, Come around back. See this wall that I, ow, there's a nail. See this wall that I built? I was gonna Pretty say, cool, did you right? cut this? I cut all these pieces perfectly and they all fit right in line. 
Wow. It's the design, the design. And that's basically it. You didn't get any snacks. I'm glad you got an activity, which I'm very curious what this activity is. All in all, I'd say I'm actually impressed. Andrew, I would like to introduce you to the mega $10,000 micro apartment. And let me tell you, we spent the entire week building this thing. We're gonna be here for a while, so let's give you a tour. We got a soccer net here so we can play soccer. We got a football. Oh! This, I'm gonna show you soon, is my favorite thing I bought. But yeah, I'm gonna save it, best for last. Some more yard activities. With oh my! First try. Oh, just as good. Yours has two, mine has three. Oh! So let's go to level one. Come on in. Wow. So this is the entry, game room, reading nook, whatever you want to call it. Got my favorite coffee right here, a coffee machine. We have a board game zone, all the best board games. So let's go up to the second story, which is the kitchen. Ow. Nuh -uh. So this isn't just any kitchen. We have an oven, but not just any oven. This is a pizza oven, Andrew. Literally can make a pizza in 90 seconds. Oh yeah, right, 90 seconds. I'll show you later, yeah. 90 seconds Great. of this thing. And then we got shelves of tons of snacks. And you're actually sitting on a refrigerator, not a fish tank. We got what? coffee, carbonated water, and only the most expensive water, Fiji. You can have whatever you want, man. Yes, an iced latte. Oh, it just hits different in a three-story micro apartment. But hey, you're actually standing by another fun feature. Look to your right here. What do you see? I see a slide. <laughs> That's right, we got a slide. Why don't you go try it? All right, I'll be back, I guess. You just slam it to the wall when you go out of here? Yeah, What's going on? I got the cushions there for you. <laughs> My light! What did you do? That's right, we have our own second story slide coming out of the micro apartment. Which leads me to my next adventure. So probably my second favorite feature of this entire build is the rock wall. Literally goes around the entire thing to get up to the third story. And then if I wanna get up there, I can. But for now, I'm just gonna jump down. Let's go up to the third story. The third story. Andrew, come on up. Dude, what the heck did you guys build? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? So obviously you have a couch that can turn into a bed, but that's not what I'm gonna be using to sleep. I'm actually gonna be sleeping in this cargo net tonight. That's right, never before seen in a micro apartment. Why did you start to stack your game consoles like that? Because then you can switch between Xbox or PS5. And we got a projector. Projects on this entire wall. Okay. It has a big weight capacity. Should I cannonball it? <laughs> got lights here. We got a bunch of pillows and blankets no so that way. we can make it cozy. Xbox games. Now that we're talking about it, this is actually second place. Rockwall's third. Yeah. Really? Just this is the fun zone. All the friends can come up. We can watch some movies, play some games. Okay. <laughs> we can play some Marvel Hitchy games. Spider Man! <laughs> when is Marvel gonna make a movie about Shuma Gorath? Guys? <laughs> oh! I forgot to get my favorite item. Oh, a fire pit. It's not just a fire pit. This is a speaker fireplace where the flames go to the base. I feel like Lady Yoda. Everything changed when I came to home. Are you serious? They got a name would remain in the book of holy. It's even cooler when you turn the lights off because this whole place lights up. Wanna see? Yeah. Oh, check it out. We got the night lights and the vibes with the fire pit. <laughs> so that's the tour, man. This is pretty incredible. So starting now, we have to spend overnight in our forts we made. That's right. So I have to go back to mine, even though I just spent a whole hour at Disneyland. Maybe you can come back later, because I got a lot of food. I can give you some of the pizza, maybe. It is 2.22. It's time to start the overnight. I'm gonna go in my house, you go in your house. Let me show you my activity that I got because it's real exciting. Avengers peel and stick stickers. Wall decals so I can decorate the whole house here. Where's Spider-Man? No, Spider-Man? These people insane. I just have to go with Iron Man. That's really all I have to do in this apartment. So I'm going to be decorating it throughout the night with Avengers things. Look at this. It's almost like a pillow. I'm going to make myself a cup of coffee and maybe play a game by myself. Man, that sounds lame. Coffee's done. Do you smell that, Andrew? No. Uh, nothing like a coffee candle mist. What? Andrew, get over here. I have a challenge for you. If you make a hole in one on your first try, I will let you go pick any one snack in the kitchen. Easy, done. You only get one try. Where do I start? No, no, no. What? From the back. I've done this a hundred times. <laughs> I bet I'd make it this time, though. 
for two. <laughs> You can pick whatever decal you want and put it on the wall. Anywhere on the wall. Holy cow. So many good choices. Is this Mrs. Marvel? No, that's Black Widow you. Gotta go with Hulk. Are you sleeping down here? Yeah. I don't want to break your wall, but it's a pretty solid wall you can push. Yeah. All right, well, thanks for inviting me over. Oh, you're leaving already? Oh, you said I could only pick one of my choice. What? Well, yeah. Now I'm done. <laughs> You don't want to like stay and hang out? Well, I have some things I have to get to. Oh. So I'll probably be back later, maybe. You gotta shut the door on your way out. Oh, don't be rude. I don't know how this happened, but there's footprints on my roof. I don't remember those being there. It's a little past lunchtime, so I think I'll make a pizza now. Let's get cooking. This thing gets up to 950 degrees. The things you do for pizza, am I right, Rick? Wait, Rick's in there? No, I'm talking to him hypothetically. Hot. You don't have a spoon, so. Pepperoni pizza. Ow. Oven is burning me hands. Here goes nothing. Now, this should cook in. Ow. Ow. Great. Should cook in 90 seconds. Wow. How did that cook so fast? Oh, that end almost got burned. Ouch. Turn this off. It's freaking hot. Did you just look at the pizza. Bon appetit. Let's give Andrew another chance to win a prize. This is kind of fun. Hey, Andrew. Do you uh, want a snack? <laughs> I got another challenge for you. If you can kick this ball into the goal from right here, you can choose any snack of your choice. My house literally has nothing, so I'll take anything, even if it was like just a single pretzel stick. <laughs> Come on, man! I don't think you understand. As soon as someone says you get one chance, it just instantly <laughs> converts an easy challenge into hard. One is the loneliest number that you ever do. I'm inviting some friends over because I want to see just how many people can fit in the micro apartment without it falling apart. Friends! Woo! That's where all the fun Whoa. activities are. Wait, you can get up with this? No. Yeah. Oh my. I'm cheating, I'm cheating. Wait. You are first. <laughs> yeah, feel free to take any snacks you guys want. Gosh, I love having guests. Oh, oh this well, is guys. pretty cool. Yeah. Can this hold people? Yeah, we both can go on there. Oh we haven't oh tested three people, though. But see, my I'm question is, jump is in. It, no, because if that I'm breaks, it's no just, way. you guys are crazy. I'm not it's testing it. Okay, this is kind of perfect. Oh, you can do, uh, the, oh my <laughs> god. Right here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we all could be doing pull-ups. No way. Fun. One. Two. Three. Guys, join in. We're having fun. Four. Rick. Five. Six. Fun. 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 to chant fun because you're having fun. That's how I know they're not having fun. How strong is this thing? You think it's so sturdy up there. I could rip this whole beam apart. Put the beam down. Uh-oh. I heard it crack. Uh oh Uh-oh. No! Why does it crack? Whoa! Can I have a cannonball on you, Drew? Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Look at all these snacks here. I missed this on the way up. <laughs> That's good. Was, guys, there's a couple of nails down here. Friends let friends steal from friends. Yeah. This place is so big, he doesn't even notice that you come and play with the toys. <laughs> Andrew? I have another challenge for you. Come over here to the rock wall and you have to try and make it to the top. As you see, I've unlatched two of those things. If you can make it to the top, you get any snack you want. Is there a time limit or I just go? You get one try. If you fall off, you lose. You can only put your hands on these. But feet can go elsewhere. No. Nope. <laughs> Keep in mind, he is 0 for 2 at these challenges, but 
third time's a charm as they uh, third time's a charm as they all say. So we're gonna keep our eye on Andrew this time. Oh crap! He might pull out swiftly. Oh shoot this. Wow, wow! Oh my there was nowhere else to hang on to. Oh crap, this is getting sweaty. Alright, we're gonna try to do it! Oh my god, this is getting sweaty. Andrew! Finally unlocks it! Oh my god, this is getting sweaty. Andrew! Finally unlocks a personal snack! For his micro apartment, go get yourself something, buddy. Yes! Let's see what he decides. Whoa, camera guy. <laughs> this is potentially my only food for the overnight, so I gotta be smart. Beef jerky. I got beef jerky. Thanks. You're welcome. Now you can go over to back to your house. Sweet baby rays. This is all over the place. Check it out guys, winding down before bed with some video games on the projector. Are you serious? Got the lights. It is just a vibe up here. Let's have some fun. Oh, darn it. That's slow with the trick. How are there bugs inside here? Would you be quiet? What? You are very loud. Guys, I literally just scored a goal. I have got to show you the instant replay because I wasn't filming. I was on a wide open breakaway. And then this happened. Oh, that's right guys. Beef jerky pillow. Not bad. All right, everybody, I'm gonna try to go to bed now. The sleeping situation is not the worst. I have slept in a lot worse places just on the channel here, so I don't anticipate it being that bad. All right, lights out. Ah, what? <laughs> Good night, look at Disneyland going. <laughs> it lights up the whole warehouse. Well, it's time to get ready for bed. And like I mentioned earlier, I'm sleeping on the cargo net. So it's time to get that set up, get a bunch of blankets on here. They get nice and cozy. These lights next door are insane. It's like 1.30 in the morning. I'm not getting any sleep. I mean, all I'm doing is laying on a wooden pallet with a carpet pad, but at least it's warm in here. It looks so cool outside. Look at that, guys. I think it's time for a midnight snack. Got plenty of options here. Gonna be sleeping good tonight, guys. See you in the morning. Good morning, guys. Right, we finally made it to morning. I can get out of this thing and go home. I wouldn't say that was the absolute worst night of sleep, but it wasn't great either. Wow, that light's bright. Cargo net's pretty comfy, but not as stability as normal bed. Your goal is to get this video to 75,000 likes. Why? Because.